Ever wondered what the top 10 places to visit in London are? Well, you're in for a treat. London, the capital of England, a city bursting with energy and rich in history, offers a myriad of experiences that cater to every kind of traveller. Whether you're captivated by the allure of ancient civilizations, enchanted by royal palaces, or intrigued by modern art, London has it all. This bustling city is a melting pot of cultures, and its attractions reflect its diverse heritage. From the iconic British Museum, brimming with centuries of art and artifacts, to the stunning Gothic architecture of Westminster Abbey, there's no shortage of sights to see. And let's not forget the vibrant Covent Garden, a paradise for foodies and shopaholics alike. So buckle up and get ready for a virtual journey through the heart of England. Stay tuned as we count down the top 10 places you must visit in London. Starting our countdown at number 10 is the British Museum. Nestled in the heart of London, the British Museum is a grand testament to human history, art and culture. With a collection spanning over two million years, it's a gateway to the past, offering an unparalleled journey through the ages. Imagine walking through the ancient Egypt gallery, where you come face to face with the Rosetta Stone, the key to deciphering Egyptian hieroglyphs. Not far away, you'll encounter the eerily fascinating Egyptian mummies, their millennia-old secrets preserved in linen and time. Then, step into the world of the Greeks and Romans, where the Elgin marbles and the Portland vase await. These masterpieces of classical artistry tell tales of gods and heroes, of love and war. But the journey doesn't end there. From the enigmatic Easter Island statue to the intricate Chinese ceramics, Every corner of the British Museum opens a new chapter of our shared heritage. And let's not forget about the Reading Room, once the workplace of illustrious minds like Karl Marx and Virginia Woolf. Its hallowed halls echo with the whispers of intellectual pursuits, a testament to the enduring power of knowledge. The British Museum is more than just a museum. It's a time capsule, a storyteller, a mirror reflecting the triumphs and tribulations of our species. The British Museum is a treasure trove of history and culture, making it a must-visit on any London itinerary. At number nine, we have the Tower of London. Imagine stepping into a thousand years of history, where each stone and corner whispers tales of royalty, rebels, and ravens. This is the Tower of London, a UNESCO World Heritage Site and one of the world's most famous fortresses. Originally built by William the Conqueror in the 11th century, the tower has served many purposes throughout its long and storied history. It's been a royal palace, mint, menagerie, armory, treasury, and even a prison. The tower's most notorious prisoners include Anne Boleyn, Sir Walter Raleigh, and Guy Fawkes. When you visit, don't forget to marvel at the crown jewels, a dazzling collection of 23,578 gemstones that are still used in royal ceremonies today. And keep your eyes peeled for the ravens. Legend has it, that if the six resident ravens ever leave the tower, the kingdom will fall. While the Tower of London might have a somewhat grim reputation, it's also a place where history comes alive. You can join a tour led by the famous Yeoman Warders, also known as Beefeaters, who share captivating stories that will transport you back in time. With its fascinating history and impressive architecture, the Tower of London is an unforgettable experience. Whether you're a history buff or just love a good tale, the Tower of London is a must visit when you're in the city. Coming in at number eight is Buckingham Palace. This grand edifice standing in the heart of London is the principal workplace and official residence of the British monarch, a symbol of the continuity of the British state for over three centuries. With its opulent facade of Portland stone, Buckingham Palace is a testament to the architectural prowess of the Victorian era. Imagine the palace in its full glory with its 775 rooms, including the lavishly decorated staterooms used for official and state entertaining. A walk through these rooms is a journey through time, a peek into the lives of the royals who once inhabited them. Now, picture the palace's grand facade becoming a stage. This is where the famous changing of the guard ceremony takes place. This centuries old tradition is a spectacle of precision and pageantry as the Queen's Guard hands over the responsibility of protecting Buckingham Palace and St. James's Palace to the new guard. The ceremony is accompanied by a band playing music that ranges from traditional military marches to songs from West End shows and even familiar pop songs. 
A visit to Buckingham Palace also offers a stroll through the perfectly manicured gardens, which is the largest private garden in London. This oasis of green in the heart of the city is a peaceful retreat from the hustle and bustle of London streets. A symbol of royal tradition, Buckingham Palace is a quintessential London attraction. At number seven on our list is the London Eye. This iconic structure, gracefully perched on the south bank of the River Thames, is more than just a giant Ferris wheel. It's a symbol of modern London, fusing architecture and entertainment in a uniquely British manner. The London Eye stands at an impressive 440 feet tall, making it one of the world's tallest observation wheels. Each rotation takes about 30 minutes, giving you ample time to soak in panoramic views of the city's skyline. As the capsules ascend, the city unfolds before your eyes, revealing an ever-changing vista of London's iconic landmarks and hidden treasures. From the top, you'll have a bird's eye view of the city's architectural wonders, including the Houses of Parliament, Big Ben and the Shard. On a clear day, you can even see as far as Windsor Castle, some 25 miles away. But the London Eye isn't just about the view. The journey itself is an experience. The sleek, futuristic capsules provide a smooth and comfortable ride, while the slow, steady rotation lets you appreciate the city's rhythm from above. So, whether you're a seasoned Londoner or a first-time visitor, the London Eye offers a fresh perspective on the city. It's a chance to see London from a new angle, to appreciate its grandeur, its diversity and its ceaseless energy. The London Eye offers a unique perspective of the city, making it a must visit for any tourist. Number six on our countdown is Westminster Abbey. An architectural masterpiece of the 13th to 16th centuries, this majestic structure stands as a testament to the intricate design and painstaking craftsmanship of its era. The Abbey, with its soaring towers and intricate stonework, is a breathtaking sight to behold. But it's not just the exterior that's impressive. Inside, the Abbey is a treasure trove of art, history and culture. Its walls echo with the footsteps of kings and queens, poets and philosophers. Here, more than 3,000 people, many of them significant figures in British history, have been laid to rest. The very stones of the Abbey are imbued with a sense of history and tradition that is palpable. The Abbey's architectural beauty extends to its stained glass windows, which cast a kaleidoscope of colours throughout the interior. The stunning Lady Chapel, with its fan-vaulted ceiling, is considered one of the finest examples of late medieval architecture in the United Kingdom. For centuries, Westminster Abbey has been the setting for royal weddings, coronations and funerals, each event adding another layer to its rich tapestry of history. It's a place where the past and the present coalesce, making it much more than just a building. It's a living, breathing chronicle of the nation's history. Steeped in history and tradition, Westminster Abbey is a London landmark not to be missed. Coming in at number five is the Tate Modern. Nestled on the vibrant south bank of the River Thames, this powerhouse of modern and contemporary art is a destination that stands testament to the progressive spirit of London. Housed in a sprawling former power station, the Tate Modern is a marvel, not just for its art, but also its architecture. The towering chimney and the vast turbine hall offer a stark industrial contrast to the colorful and thought-provoking art pieces it contains. From Picasso to Warhol, the Tate Modern's collection is a veritable who's who of the 20th and 21st century art scene. Paintings, sculptures, installations, and films from artists around the globe are beautifully displayed across its cavernous spaces, each piece telling its own unique story. But the Tate Modern isn't just about the art on its walls. It's also about engaging with art in new and innovative ways. Here, you can immerse yourself in interactive exhibits, join lively debates, or even take part in workshops that challenge your own creative boundaries. And let's not forget about the stunning panoramic views of London from the Tate Modern's viewing platform. It's a site that is, in itself, a work of art. For art enthusiasts, the Tate Modern is an absolute must visit. It's a place that challenges, inspires and captivates, offering a unique perspective on the world through the lens of modern and contemporary art. Number four on our list is the Houses of Parliament and Big Ben. Nestled on the banks of the River Thames, these landmarks are the very heartbeat of London. The Houses of Parliament, also known as the Palace of Westminster, is where the two Houses of the Parliament of the United Kingdom meet. 
This magnificent edifice, with its ornate Gothic revival architecture, has been a witness to the shaping of British history for hundreds of years. Then, there's Big Ben, standing tall and proud. Though many refer to the whole tower as Big Ben, the name actually belongs to the massive bell inside the clock tower. The tower itself, now officially called the Elizabeth Tower, is one of the most recognisable symbols of London. Its iconic chimes have marked the passage of time for Londoners for over 150 years. Whether cloaked in the soft light of dawn, bathed in the glow of the afternoon sun, or illuminated against the night sky, these landmarks never fail to inspire awe. The sight of these structures, accompanied by the resonant tolling of Big Ben, is a quintessential London experience. One can also take a guided tour of the Houses of Parliament to delve into its rich history and marvel at its architectural grandeur. From the opulent Lord's Chamber to the Commons Chamber, where heated debates take place, there's so much to discover. The Houses of Parliament and Big Ben are iconic symbols of London that every visitor should see. At number three, we have Covent Garden. A place of vibrancy and high spirits, Covent Garden is more than just a location, it's a phenomenon. Nestled in the heart of London, it's a bustling district that never sleeps, a hub of activity that offers something for everyone. Imagine a place where the past and present blend seamlessly together. That's Covent Garden for you. Its rich history is etched in every cobblestone of its piazza, every brick of its buildings. Once a bustling fruit and vegetable market, it has transformed into a modern day mecca for shopping, dining and entertainment. Here you'll find a plethora of boutique shops, each with their own unique offerings. From high-end fashion to quirky curiosities, there's a shop to match every whim and fancy. And when hunger strikes, the area offers a smorgasbord of culinary delights. From traditional British fare to exotic international cuisines, foodies will find themselves spoilt for choice. But Covent Garden is not just about shopping and dining. It's also a stage where artists of all kinds get to showcase their talents. From mesmerizing street performances to world-class operas at the Royal Opera House, there's always something to stir your senses. As the sun sets, the area takes on a different vibe. The streets come alive with music, laughter, and the clinking of glasses, as locals and visitors alike revel in the district's vibrant nightlife. Covent Garden is a hub of activity, offering something for everyone. The day may end, but the spirit of Covent Garden never does. It's a place that celebrates life in all its wonderful chaos. Coming in at number two is the British Library. A paradise for bibliophiles, the British Library is one of the world's largest and most significant libraries. Its shelves stretch for over 400 miles and hold over 150 million items. This isn't just a collection of books though. Here you'll find all forms of written knowledge, from ancient papyrus scrolls to digital publications. It's a treasure trove of human thought, creativity and discovery, spanning over 2,000 years. The library's collection includes some of the most important documents in history. The Magna Carta, a cornerstone of British constitutional law, is among its prized possessions. You can also marvel at the beautifully illuminated Lindisfarne Gospels or the world's earliest dated printed book, the Diamond Sutra. The British Library is not just about old books and manuscripts, it's a vibrant, modern institution that hosts exhibitions, talks and performances. It's a place where scholars and researchers come to delve into their subjects, where writers come to craft their stories, and where the public comes to explore and learn. The library's airy, modernist building, located in the heart of London, invites visitors to linger, spend an afternoon browsing the collections, or simply find a quiet corner and lose yourself in a good book. For book lovers, a visit to the British Library is a dream come true. And finally, at number one on our list is the Natural History Museum. A crown jewel in London's collection of world-renowned museums, the Natural History Museum is a true testament to the wonders of our planet. Housed in a breathtaking Victorian building, this museum is an adventure into the natural world that begins the moment you step through the door. As you navigate through the museum, you'll be met with exhibits that explore the rich tapestry of life on Earth. From ancient fossils to precious gemstones, each exhibit tells a unique story about our planet's past. Be prepared to come face to face with a towering Diplodocus skeleton in the grand entrance hall, reminding us of the colossal creatures that once roamed our world. The museum's prized collection of over 80 million items is divided into five main sections, botany, entomology, mineralogy, 
paleontology and zoology. Each section offers a fascinating glimpse into different aspects of the natural world. Whether it's marvelling at the intricate beauty of butterfly wings or stepping back in time with the dinosaur exhibit, there's something for every nature lover. And let's not forget the Darwin Centre, a state-of-the-art scientific research and collections facility. Here, you can witness science in action as researchers work on real specimens in the laboratory. The Natural History Museum is a must-visit for anyone with a curiosity about the natural world. So these were the top 10 places you must visit in London. A journey that started at the treasure-filled British Museum took us to the historic Tower of London and let us marvel at the grandeur of Buckingham Palace. We soared above the city on the London Eye and delved into the nation's past at Westminster Abbey. Our cultural exploration continued at the Tate Modern before we admired the iconic houses of Parliament and Big Ben. Covent Garden offered us a taste of London's vibrant day and night life, while the British Library invited us to lose ourselves in a world of literature. We ended our journey at the awe-inspiring Natural History Museum, a testament to the wonders of the natural world. London, a city brimming with history, culture and life, has so much more to offer. Please like, comment and subscribe to the channel as we frequently put out new videos. Why not check out some of our other videos of places around the world? We hope this guide inspires you to explore the many wonders of this vibrant city. Until next time, happy travels.